What's up? Well, I got it back. Kinda. It's in one piece for the most part, but they stole all my tools that I had in the back and punched out the door lock and ripped out the ignition. But they were nice enough to leave my tunnel cover, so I guess that's a bonus. But let's flip this around here and show you what they did. Uh, door handle, door lock. And they looks like they just used a pair of vice grips on the ignition after they ripped that little plastic cap off. Um, I guess they were trying to figure out how to take my DVD player off. So they can mess with that, but they abandoned it beforehand. So I guess what they did is they stole it around 6 a.m. And then they, about 3.20, I, I got, somebody messaged me on Facebook. They got, I got a video of it. It had a car dolly hooked up to it. And they were robbing a shop or something like that, not too far away from where we live. And that was like 3.20, 3.30. And then they brought it back to the neighborhood where we live at, or kind of behind behind where we live at. And they abandoned it there, left the car dolly and, and everything else attached to it. So I guess all that happened um, after I called, or before I called the cops. So it was brought back to the neighborhood. The people that saw it said around 6.30 to me. And I didn't report it stolen until closer to 7. So I guess they brought, they, they went, stole it, used it, and brought it back, or abandoned it, before I even called the police on it. So luckily it's still in mostly one piece, but we're going to make some modifications to where they can't take it anymore. Take it easy.